After Robot entered the portal, the enhanced version of the frequency that he was emitting that hurts Viltrum might stop. Invincible immediately gained his strength back and got up. He said, holy f***. He ripped out his hair until he had a mohawk, and then he took Invincible Mohawk's suit and then gave him his. It was just on time for when General Creech came, but he had a piece of hair left and he ripped that out. General Creech asked what happened and he said, isn't it obvious? The very people who helped me to escape Angstrom's dimension and allowed me to bring him back here to harness his powers killed him and tried to halt our progress. One of them escaped with the technology into another dimension. This is priority one. He told General Creech that he will have to handle all his duties as Emperor until the project is completed. I will go now and seek someone with the means of helping us expand our glorious Viltrum Empire into countless other dimensions. Invincible flew off as fast as he could to the one place he thought he could get help, the Teen Teen's original base. He was looking for Robot, the only one smart enough to replicate his robot's technology. He found him but Robot thought he was Invincible Mohawk.